Do him. Do you ever take dance lessons? Did anybody ever take dance lessons at Arthur Murray's dance studios? That's what she asked me. And you know, some of the men that hang out at that place, they take their women for thousands and thousands of dollars. Yep. Did you know that? Yeah, only ten. I've read that. It's true. It's true, I guess. Well, anyway, she asked me if I learned how to dance like this at Arthur Murray Dance Studio. She said she was looking for her partner. I says, no, ma'am, I learned how to dance like this throwing a cast net for mullet. And she looked at me kind of funny, just like that lady over there. And she, but what do you mean? How do you learn to dance like that throwing a cast net for mullet? Well, I told her, I says, if you've ever thrown a cast net over a school of mullet, you pull up about 10 or 12 of them onto your dock or into your boat and make a little dump them out on the dock or on that boat and make a little noise like this. And then once they all stop jumping, you go down to pick one up. And he does this. And then they all go off. And then you can pick them up, ladies and gentlemen. That's how I, I learned to dance like this, keep a beat with my feet like this, throwing it cast and every mother. And I hooked up with that lady, really. I was with her for about uh, almost a year. Uh, and I was going to marry her, too, 52 cast nets later. <laughs> but then, you know, we was out on the dance floor dancing cheek to cheek. And I got one of these fishing lure hooks stuck in her corner of her mouth, in her cheek there. We ended up at the emergency room, ladies and gentlemen, together. We ended up at the emergency room. I spent six hours in there with that woman. That was a night I was going to ask her to marry me. Six hours with her. Took me three bottles of peroxide to get all the blood out of my hat, and she broke it off with me that night. Nerve of her. She even asked for the boat and the truck back too. I'm telling you folks.